search of Vice President Kamala Harris, the nominee of the Democratic Party, for a running mate is in its final phase. Now, the Harris has been interviewing the finalist vice presidential candidates over the weekend. The law firm, Convington and the Burling had done the vetting for the campaign. And now Harris is understood to have shortlisted six candidates so far to be her running mate for which the formal announcement is expected by Tuesday. The six candidates are Pennsylvania Governor Josh Shapiro, Minnesota Governor Tim Walz of Minnesota, Arizona Senator Mark Kelly, Kentucky Governor Andy Besher, Illinois Governor J.B. Pritzer and Transportation Secretary Pete Buttick. Some of the factors that Harry is considering is picking her running mate uh, can, who can help her win by expanding the support base, who shares her values, who she would have a better working relationship with and who would be best suited to take over the president in case of contingency. Okay, joining me on the broadcast is a former diplomat, uh, Suresh Goel. Mr. Goel, we appreciate you joining on the broadcast. Now, as we can understand, the race for picking up the final as the running mate for U.S. Vice President Kamala Harris is concerned is underway. A formal announcement is on the cards to be made by Tuesday. But what essentially needs to be looked into the perspective while choosing one of these six who have been shortlisted so far, what likely is going to be the top uh, we can understand as the characteristic or a feature which will be given the highest priority given the situation which the Democratic Party stands right now. Uh, Simran, I think all the six who have been shortlisted, they more or less match the criterion which would be the topmost in uh, consideration for presidential nominee Kamala Harris and that is that it is going to be male, it is going to be uh, a white, it is going to be uh, somebody with conservative family values. Uh, and therefore, now it's going to be really who will get the maximum kind of leverage in terms of voting pattern. Uh, so it's for a tough call. There are very prominent in the Shapiro is there, Mark Kelly is there, uh, the former transport secretary is there competing for the same position. I think it's going to be really a choice to be made that come. Kamala Harris, but where exactly she lives is very, very difficult to see. But I think so far the shortlisting is really in terms of the criterion which one would think is the top most important issue. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.